everybody, welcome back to the Craft Beer Hub. I am really excited. This isn't a beer review. Um, I don't normally do unboxings on the channel, but this is a big one for me personally, because this is the first time, and it won't be a lot of it won't be a special thing for a lot of you guys, but it's something that I've been meaning to do for a long time, and I've finally done it. I've made a purchase with the Sierra Nevada Cascade Club. Obviously, Sierra Nevada, generally speaking. Their pale ale is one of my go-to beers. Um, if I go into it, like every everywhere does it, Tesco's, Morrison's, I believe even Asda does it. Um, Asda even got in some of the different Sierra Nevada pale stuff, wild little thing or hazy little thing, I think they were called, those 330 cans. But yeah, Sierra Nevada are brilliant. The pale ale is amazing. I like a can of the Californian IPA as well. It's a bonus, and it's, it's, a, it's a bonus that it's normally in, um, is it a 355 or a 375 milliliter <coughs> can? Got a lot of time for that. <coughs> so yeah, I've been threatening to do it for a long time, but I've finally done it. Um, I've got my phone here. I've got the prices for you. Um, there was a bit of discount on there as well. But let's go into it. Let's do a bit of an unboxing and see what we got in our Sierra Nevada Cascade Club order. Let's start off by getting the box open. It's so cool they put that sticker on there. I mean, that is just any, many, well, I say any beer drinker. You know, you see that logo and you know exactly what it is. Um, <clears throat> right. Jesus, it's well packaged. <clears throat> Got some stuff in here from Sierra Nevada saying, cheers for ordering our beers. We really hope you enjoy them. Cheers to Sierra Nevada team. Fair play. Cheers, guys. Um, a leaflet on it with some picking, picking details for the, that was their admin side, I suppose. Got some of that. Got some of that. Right. Let's do the 330 cans first. <clears throat> The first can out, I say 330, it's a three. What is this? A 355. This is bigger than 330. Is it a 350, 355? I don't know. It does normally say. It's a 12 fluid ounce, whatever that is in British money. Um, it's a Sierra Nevada Liquid Hoppiness IPA at 7%. Um, most of these beers I've heard about through Paul's Beer Reviews. I know he absolutely loves Sierra Nevada. Um, and I've heard him talk about pretty much all of these beers in this box. So yeah, that's the first one. Where am I going to put these? Um, the second one is, I know it's October, but I do like a lager. So I got a can of their Summer Fest, crisp summer lager. I love a lager. I've really got into my lagers the last 12 months. So really looking forward to that. What ABV is that? 5% I think this one was. Does normally say their their writing's really small. Yeah, five percent. There we go. So that should be pretty blooming nice. And um, now we're on to the four forty cans. Right, the big boy. This is barrel aged narwhal. There we go. This is an eleven point nine percent stout. Um, yeah, that's just going to be banging. I've never had. I've I've never had a Sierra Nevada lager. I've had a pale and an IPA from there. A few different pales and an IPA from Sierra Nevada. So yeah, stout is going to be a new um, style for me from Sierra Nevada. So I'm really looking forward to that. Americans can brew some really good stouts. And um, if anyone's going to do it, Sierra Nevada are going to do it, aren't they? Um, the next beer is called Resist. The Anti-Imperial IPA. Obviously, um, it's... A bold West Coast style IPA to support the Drinkers for Ukraine fundraising efforts. Fair enough. What an excuse to drink a beer. A 7.5% West Coast style IPA. That should be really good. Sierra Nevada. I've heard nothing but great things about their uh, West Coast stuff. Um, and on that theme, we have kind of their... This is a limited release small batch FOMO beer. Fear of missing out. It is a West Ghost IPA. <laughs> Ah, I love that. It's kind of got this really cool metallic Pac-Man um, can wrap on it. That's really cool. 7.2%. Um, that should be absolutely amazing. Um, next, and th this is the final beer. This is a lager. Called, it's one of their limited release small batch FOMO lagers. It's called Widen the Aperture. It's 5% and it's a Pilsner style lager. 
there we go it's kind of got a really cool kind of um polaroid effect thing with lots of different sierra nevada photos on it on the camera that's really cool um and finally i had to i simply had to i don't have any i don't have any sort of merch or anything from sierra nevada so whilst i was there i got a glass and i'll be using this glass in about 20 minutes because i'm filming this just before going on a live stream with tom the crummy beard if you don't know who he is go and check his channel out i just got a classic looking sierra nevada glass that was so talking prices actually we didn't talk prices the sierra, sierra nevada glass was four pounds fifty which i think is worth it nice kind of it's kind of a cross between a long glass and a, and a traditional pint glass um the West Ghost IPA with the really cool camera app. That was £4.60. And I don't think that's bad. A four, it's a 473 can. 7.2%. It's going to be top draw beer. £4.60? I don't think that's bad. The Lager. Widen the aperture. That was 320 I know Lagers tend to be a little bit cheaper. The Anti-Imperial IPA, 7%, was £3.40. The Narwhal, see I think this might be in the bargain of the lot. An American brewed barrel aged stout at nearly 12% in a 16 fluid ounce can. That was 750, which I think is not bad. And then the Liquid Hoppiness, that was 320. And then the Summerfest Pilsner was 230. And then so that kind of that kind of came to uh, and then I use a discount code, which I still think is active, called capital letters, all capital letters, newsletter10, and that got me 10% off. So, delivered these beers, six beer, <clears throat> six beers and a glass, 32 quid. I don't think that's bad. I really don't think that's bad delivered as well. <coughs> yeah, so I'm going to really enjoy tucking into those. I've actually got, like I say, I've got um, a live stream coming up with Tom in a bit. I'm probably going to do the two lagers, or three, or two or three lagers, whatever it was in there. Um, before I crack open something else. So yeah, thanks very much for watching, guys. Bit of a different video. I hope you liked it. Um, if you don't know what, if just to just to sort of clarify, I, I purchased these beers. I didn't. I didn't get any sponsorship. I wish they'd look at me for sponsorship. That'd be amazing, wouldn't it? But I just just go to the Cascade Club, Google it. It will come up. And I think you just got to make a make an account. Um, and then yeah, they've got them all on there. And then you obviously use the code newsletter ten to get ten percent off. Simple as that. Thanks very much for watching, guys. I appreciate you uh, watching this slightly different video. I hope you enjoyed it. Like and subscribe if you would be so kind. I will see you on the next one. Cheers.